Hello everybody and welcome back to the next part of our Wolf Quest adventure of Purple's life here. And yeah, today we are going to be finally hopping over to Slough Creek and establishing a territory. And I may have been off a bit more than I can chew, but well, you guys will just have to wait and see. And yeah, hope you enjoy and if you do, please hit that like and subscribe button and I will see you all. In the video. Skip tips, I think I know what I'm doing. The real thing is, is that I have always been based in this location. These have always been, first meadow and stuff has always been my locations. We're going to second meadow. We're going to be living up here. So we've got quite a journey ahead of us. If I don't get stuck in a crevasse. It's not actually a crevasse, it's just a little crevice. Crevasse. Very, much larger. I always forget that that animation exists. Got a long journey ahead. At least all the rivers and stuff should be frozen or mostly frozen. I say as these, uh, this is definitely not even close to being fro fully frozen. Ugh, I hate the rivers. Okay. We go east, past these moose, because we don't really want to mess with them. That's cute. It's gonna be really weird. I probably shouldn't be doing this as my first Iron Wolf, but like, I don't know. I want to. I never see the other side of the map. I'm so used to this side of the map that I am very comfortable playing. And it's not really the biggest things that will kill my pups now is just illness. It's just not something you can do anything about. So I really want to get. A feel for a different area. Want to add some challenge back? <laughs> not the game's not challenging, but I don't know. It's going to be fun, or I'm going to die before our first litter of pups even sees it to their twenty-pound mark. I have to remember that I can die, because I'm so used to playing where death is... I, I, I don't die frequently, I've only- I think I only died with Mellow like two or three times. But... I have to play a lot more cautiously. It's something I have to remember. And I am always such... So reliant on that meadow because it's so easy to find fawns and stuff at the end of the game in the spring. It's gonna be a different bowl game. Reality because I, I turn off tips and then they still show up, which is really annoying. But in reality. Since I'm playing as Purple, who was Mellow's last pup, she probably would have moved into that the same den site that she was born in, but oh well. Like they're play I've never been on this side of the map before. Oh swim. Swim like your life depends on it. The only problem is that I have to get over here before they take up the whole territory. It's annoying. I should start marking territory now, though. I'm gonna claim the center part and then I'm gonna start stealing from them. I'm looking for a suitable den site. Uh, 
I say as I'm running straight into their territory. I feel wrong. I've got- I normally have this down to a science and now I just feel wrong. You run through hexes so quickly when you're not actually Try paying attention to the hexes that you're going through. You also have to keep an eye out for dens. Okay, now let's go up a bit. We are going to take these as well, but I just want to get this part done first. Not run into a rock. Don't cause a scene. Seriously! So I can't take- I really wish you could take those- It really annoys me when you can't take those hexes. I thought it was just- I understand the need- I'm like, this hex and then those around it, fine, but all the stuff down here you should be able to take. Okay. How many is that? Four. I'm gonna try to take this one and then loop this way. I need 15, so that's 3, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Yeah, so that's plenty big. And it'll still somewhat overlap with what I'm familiar with. I'm a little concerned over the fact that I haven't found any dinosaurs yet. Speak of the devil and he shall appear. I won't have the den there because way too close to enemy territory, but I'm surprised these guys haven't shown up yet. Figured we would have had a fight on our hands by this point. So that's there, then take this one, then we swing down. Okay, that's not what I meant. Again. I didn't even see them. I'm not focusing too much on the dens out here. I will, like I said, expand my territory out this way eventually. But for right now, I just want to get like the center portion that I'm really gonna protect. Hmm. 
Might try to steal some of those hexes later. My goal is to have a pretty large territory this go around. But I'm glad that you don't have to do this every single time now. That it saves your territory. Now this den, I might take. It's centrally located. The biggest issue though is that it is kind of open. So we'll have to see what else we find. Looks like it's a floodplain. Uh, we stay with Shadow Pack. Why does that sound like it doesn't? Finishing my territory first. Not ready. This looks like a floodplain. So, maybe not the best idea to have a den here. And even if it's not, it's a lot of gravel, which means you probably won't have as many elk or anything grazing here but I don't know how like deep the game goes with that stuff now we go this way ish right and more west Yeah, I don't think they're happy with me. Like a den in like this sort of area. We are working. Quit playing. We need dens nearby. No, of course not. not seeming to get closer to it. I think I'm going the wrong way. Yeah. Crisscrossing back and forth. I don't really like the sand ends. I want something that's a bit more sheltered. Mm. But it would protect from.
Where is the den that we literally just saw? What did I have? Let me just look on the map. I think this is my best bet, and then once when this flea load gets bad, we move down here. So I have time to deal with this. I don't even know if I can take that one. I think that might be my best bet. I'm not used- I think- I don't think you have to dig out the, like, the ones under the rocks and stuff. It's a little weird, like, oh, I have to do this again. Oh god, how many pups are they gonna saddle this with? Yeah, I can work with the other stuff. I just would prefer. Oh my god, there's so many of them. We're not naming them tonight. Here we go. One, two, three, and three. Oh my god, you've got a red. You are like bright red. Oh, we got one whitish one. Too white. You're more of a yellow color. Actually, you're like pure white. 